I'm going to change it to the wrong scene again. You are doing. Because pro streamer. All right, did we actually get a save to work? No. No. You said you chose no just now. There you go. Spoopy. Yeah, she didn't want us burning through the crackers. Told me to bring two boxes. I'm like, I'm not eating that much of this. Need for Speed Pro Stream. What? You said you were a pro streamer. I said Need for Speed Pro Stream. Pro Stream was actually a pretty good one. It was okay. I kind of lost all the flair of the Underground series. It and did. didn't get the controls that it really needed to be a proper racing game. I like Oh, the... look at Scoob. He's just stuck. Scoob! Where are you? Door just open. Some dungeon. I'm actually more concerned about the size of this frigging dungeon. What's that? It's just gonna be that. Nope. Stream needs more four year old. <laughs> yeah, there are laws about how many hours we're allowed to work than four year olds on stream, right? <laughs> What I love is our Necros apparently just hires a whole bunch of people to pretend to be zombies constantly. Right. Nope. That and, skull isn't working. Well, and this... Oh, that that's... Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, funny. Yeah, funny, Drez. Wow. Hate is gonna hate, I guess. Wait, do I... Is this... Nope. No, not that one. Can't do anything with any of those. It has to be glowing. Fair enough. Found something. What? Oh, oh the wall opened. And spooked oh, it you. spooked him. Yikes! It's the mask from that spooky snow ghost. He, he passed out on the ride home. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he had a lot of excitement. He nearly won uh, all the games, actually. Yeah, like, he's got this freaking dungeon, basically, with a maze in it and random skele and random human skeletons. You'd think that this would be someone who could just buy whatever he wanted, given the amount of money he'd have to sink into this. What? That's a different door. No, it wasn't. It's a different door on each side. Yes. There's nothing over here. Nope. Can I just... You know, heck with it. Take the leap. <laughs> I mean, it's like four stories up. It's a stone. So that door looks like that. And then it looks like that. Yep. And yet they are the same door. It's according pretty impressive. To, according to the game. Oh. Is my mouse on this? No, it's okay. The weird cheese dip. I'll be honest, I actually like the crackers better than the cheese dip. Crackers got a nice flavor. Um, probably when we finish this game, because this is the last level. Yep. As I shove food in my face and a gnat flies in my face. There's a door, I think. Oh no, that's just around the corner. Oh. We're done with that. Yeah. Well, we just needed a small snack. To oh. There's a door. What I love is he doesn't care that you're there. He's just there to spook me. Yeah. All right, hold on. He's a just there. What was that? He is, in fact, three spoopy, five me. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's not two spoopy, four. Can I put this on? No. Boink. I like, like the effect. Boink, man. It's a hook. Oh my god. Dead by dawn. De what I love is like this whole. This is like a freaking creepy 
There's an Iron Maiden over there. Like, I should look someplace else. I think someone died in there. <laughs> and there's like maces and the like stretching table. This is the horrible. Rack. And there's a skeleton on it now. It's a different rack. There are two of them. Okay. Well, there's a dead. There's a dead person. So that's all we needed from there. There's more skeletons up there. If you drink a bunch of coffee on an empty stomach, you're gonna have a bad time. I mean, that's. To be fair, if you drink any coffee on an empty stomach, it's not gonna be great. And see if you can go left or right here. I was about to. Oh. That's that's funny. They oh, hi bud. <laughs> So, trick with mazes, and, you know, even if they're the most confusing thing ever, now you always, question, are you, back? Oh, this is definitely a different you door. follow the left side ah, of the character, go. and you will, oh. They're not actually black knights, they're just, they're literally just the scout, the, uh, yeah. Oh, I remember this level. This is also a fairly large one. We could really use some bug spray right about now, huh, Scoob? <laughs> that's a that's a spider though, not a bug. Also, is that the medieval guy? That is the Black Knight. No, no, the the skull skull on the wall. That's the medieval guy. The medieval guy? Oh, yeah. That that's, is, that's that's a bad time a bad for your time, quick yeah. tries. You need to put some food in there, man. Spider door? Spider door. Does whatever a door does. Because it's not actually a spider. It's just a big old door. Look out. Here comes a spider door. So we have, like, full-on graveyard. There's some fresh dug graves. Some freshly buried graves. Well, I graves. mean, he's but, left some of the skeletons on the rack. Yeah, but look. These are some freshly reburied graves. Hammer to knock his head in. It's a hammer Scooby-Doo. It's a hammer Scooby- Oh my god. Stop. Excuse Just me. Stop. I had the hiccups while I did that. It's a hammer Scooby-Doo. So, what he actually <laughs> needs to do is just climb the fence, figure out where he is, and call the police. Do you, do you see the background? Like, zoinks. Wait, what is that? This is one big fish, huh, Scoob? The bats will spook oh, you. Oh, frig. I didn't even realize they were real. Really real. Oh, yeah, except for I eat them. It's locked. Oh, good. There are more doors <clears throat> back in the, uh... In the maze, yeah. yeah. No, not in the maze. In that uh, in that area where you need, where you found the spider. Oh, okay. I believe there are no more doors in the maze, which would be good. I do enjoy that it's almost impossible to get spooked by those guys. They just kind of walk on by. But also, how much is our Necros paying these guys to just walk around? And go, he, well, I mean, maybe they're like Mr. Skeletal, and they just really like to spook people. Ah. What? You oh, could go back, uh, go back to the main area. What else is there? That looks like another Iron Maiden. It is not. This gate's too heavy to open. Maybe we can find a way to make it easier to open. Um. Is, oh. Is, is, uh, uh. Yep. I just got spooked by something on the other side of a giant heavy... There's some tentacles over there, my dude. Yeah, on the other side yeah, of they a... they spooping, though. Would you not be spooked? I'd be pretty spooked. I'd be like, what's this octopus thing doing under here? What the heck's going on, our necros? All he's doing... struggling so much with these camera angles. Okay. This fish is tiny. It would barely even be a snack. I can't even do it. Wait, hold on. <clears throat> it would barely make a snack even if it was cooked. I like the implication that you might eat it raw. Right. I. 
Also, there's Oggy Doggy and Doggy Daddy. Um, you are missing one fish. Yes, yes, I am. I bet you there's a secret if you have all the fish. Uh, I bet you know? there's an answer. Oh, Yes, I need to eat Scooby oh, Snacks. Scooby Snacks! There are even more doors? Yeah. What are you talking about? I believe there are more. There are... Oh my god, Scooby, you're making this horrible control even worse. No, there's just the go upstairs. Back, uh, go towards the camera currently. Yeah. Away from the stairs, yeah. Yeah, we went through this door. We did not go through that door over there where there's clearly a uh, bug. There you go. There's an item here. There's not a door. Went through the spider door. But somewhere there's got to be a way to uh... no, because that's back in the maze. Yeah, but I didn't finish the maze. No. I mean, I'm pretty sure you did. I think. God, these controls are friggin'. Terra bad sometimes. I mean, you do that. Awesome. So, Blind corner mouse. Okay, so we did finish the maze. So legit, I do not remember um, where in particular it is. Trying to work a mini dresses costume. I don't remember where it is, but there is in fact bug spray. You do put there in is, where? Uh, in, in this level. Oh. Yeah, I, I kind of assumed since they said I needed bug spray. I just don't know what the heck a music box is gonna do me. Oh, there's a place of for good. it. So we've been through that door. We haven't been through this big one at the end there. Ooh, and there's that last fish. Wow, this fish is huge. Now the question is, where is the room with the fish? There it is. Oh my god, Scooby, you're shoving me into the damn wall. Did you get spooked? That is an amazing trick. I want that Dude, in my house. Can Scoob. You're being no. more annoying than my real dog. Dude. I start walking that way nice and slow, and he pushes me all the way back into the room. Uh you gotta get the industrial sharpies. Are we in another maze? Yes. Awesome. All of yourself. Oh, it's catacombs! Look at that. We are in the catacombs. Alright, where's the Crypt Keeper? Or we could do like the one guy did in the catacombs the one time. What? There was a guy who stole a skull from the catacombs, posted about it on the internet, and then desecrated it. Hey, look, it's Daphne, and she's all chained up. I can't believe you guys found me. I've been lost down here for hours. You're, you're chained up. What do you mean you've been lost down here for yeah. hours? Jeepers, also, watch out. Here comes the ghoul on. king. Hold, hold on. She was chained up, and yet we were apparently able to unchain her without any... Uh... Yeah. Here comes the ghoul king. And he just... He ignores you, but he does <laughs> drop something. Look, Scoob. He <laughs> drops something. <laughs> Iron key, a rusty key for outside. Gee, I wonder where that goes. Could be other stuff in this maze, though. I'm doing. Yeah, that's why you have to use the industrial, industrial oh, yeah. sharpies. They're actually more toxic 
They're the they're the original Sharpies, basically. I didn't realize that there were multiple kinds. Yeah, they're the ones with the red label. Huh? Um, and there's like warnings on them and such. Interesting. Uh, like the the the. What I didn't open that. Yeah, they changed the formula a little bit, like Drez is saying, and the industrial ones are like the old school Sharpies that were like super good. Ah. Uh, ooh. I would really like to just walk where I'm aiming. Yeah, sometime. but that's not going to work that way. Yeah, Scoob Scooby, it's the mask from that creepy witch doctor. <laughs> oh my gosh. <clears throat> yeah, it's usually I'll buy a box of those industrial ones for the garage and whatnot. I mean, they, they still aren't as good as... Um, I don't know, I think uh, the ones that I like are the Milwaukee ones that they sell at Home Depot. But they're a few bucks a marker. That's um, a little expensive. But they, they, they do work really nice, and they don't roll away because they're, like, triangular. And, uh -huh. you know, Good stuff. It's, there, there's little things that are nice about them, but also, you know, they're... Yeah, it's got to be that whole area, though. Yep. Oh, fuck sake. Shaggy. It's a mouse, dude. You have a great day. You could eat the mouse, he's, but no. He's not gonna eat the mouse. It's, what? Do you, do you see the weird movement I'm I fighting with right? Wait, this isn't the right way, is it? No, that's where the uh, that's where the um, what what you call it is. That's where the tentacle is. Oh, the tentacle monster, right? I've seen this anime. It gets really weird. I'm glad I have not seen this anime. <laughs> lies. I'm calling you, your, you out on that one. That's lies. <laughs> I we're we're going to stop right there, though. Despite the joke, I don't think I've ever actually seen... You know, there's okay. the joke about things. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen weird. anything with... All right. We found a net. I'm I'm gonna bet we're gonna use that to catch something or someone. Wow, that's like a little on the nose. A little on the nose. Oh, I think there's something inside of here. Hey, Scooby, maybe we can find something. Okay, <clears throat> he's gonna remove the nails. So what I like is that, like, once again, that's a good noise. It's working, school. It's working. It's a dead Freddy. No, it's a perfectly alive Freddy. No, he's dead. Thanks, guys. I thought it was a goner for sure. Hey, we found Fred. <clears throat> now we need to find the others. Here, take this bug sprayer. It might come in handy. I found it in this casket, along with some ladder rungs. Weird things to have in a casket. Well, hold on, hold on. He's locked in the casket, yep. and he happens to find a bug sprayer and ladder rungs inside of it. So someone locked him in the casket and left a bug sprayer and ladder rungs in it. Uh, my main question is, so our Necros was actually planning to kill him, given that he had actually nailed him into the casket. Right. Like, this was proper attempted murder. A bug sprayer. I like the look of the bug sprayer because you know, we don't see old like, school style. That kind yeah. doesn't... We found Daphne, but the Ghoul King chased her away. Ghoul King? I'll look for Daphne. You two look for Velma, and don't forget to look for clues along the way. I think he's getting a clue for Daphne. I think he is. Oh, there's, there's the ladder rungs. Really? He found them, but he just left them there. Look, lat rungs for a ladder. We could use these. So where does Shaggy keep ladder. all of these things? He doesn't have a backpack. He's got um, he's got sword space or uh, hammer space. Hammer space. Hammer space. Um, I mean, I could tell you, but let's just put it this way: he's good at smuggling things. Well, we do that part. He wasn't allowed to have that in Michigan until recently. 
Oh, jeez. <sighs> Just running away from Scooby like, screw that dog. Not that it matters. He will simply reappear next to you. I don't want him to because he keeps getting in my way. He does that. What a bad dog. Bad dog. What? 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 You saw that, right? Like, that wasn't just me. It was just you. That was that was five scene changes in a row. Yeah, you went back and forth. But... I was holding one direction. I yep. wasn't letting go and changing direction. That's the problem, though. I, I'm guessing that's some deep. I'm actually more concerned with the fact that it just makes the spider completely disintegrate. So I came through, and I'm facing this door. Is that the door I came through? Yes. So I, I went through the door, walked 360 degrees. Turned, yeah, you turned 360 degrees and... Walked back out the door. I was going to say, I don't recommend that. That's a big face. Can you... You are not going to... That's not a good idea. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Right here. Wait, what? All the way back here? Uh, yeah, you're just... No, you can just go get the frickin' bug spray. You have the bug spray here. Yes, I'm trying to walk in the correct direction, but you see... These scene changes are not healthy. I like that sound effect, actually. I don't recommend going in that room right away. Let's see what else is down this hall. More doors. Oh, it's one of these. Okay. <laughs> Scooby Dooby Doo. Yeah, I was gonna say. Where are you? You need some something, something. I'm actually very disappointed. What the hell was that? Come on now. <laughs> Check this out. It's like a uh, clock. Am I gonna get hurt if I walk into a gear? Probably. You're pro you might get spooked, but you can't get hurt in this game. Yeah. This game's rated G for gore. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's that's how ladder repair. That's how ladder repair works. Yes. Yeah. That's how mafia works. That's a. That's how. Hey mafia Scoob, works. you stay here while I look around. Okay. <laughs> bad. I like Scooby has no problem with just sitting there. I you see something yes, glowing. You have to go to the other side of the gears. And there's even more ladder too. Oh no. What? What? Yeah, you can go you can still continue to, to continue to the left. Nope. Down, down, down. Behind the gear. Try to continue to the left. Okay, that's some real awful perspective. Like groovy. Tibetan chimes, man. I'm gonna use these while me and Scoob have some Scooby snacks. I, I, I said Scooby snacks. <laughs> I bet Scooby snacks. So that's what I said. I said what I said. That looks like some murder machines. Oh. There's a thing. Zoinks. Oh. Wow, it's that scary Black Knight's head. I, I read what it said. I just decided I, to say that. I figure. What? That, that's more ladder. Awful lot of ladders around here. What? You got spooked. No, I... You can't go that way, they're spooping. Can't tell if I can go this way either, because perspective. Small gear, maybe I can put this somewhere. Up your butt.
lazy mode. Velma! <clears throat> Shaggy, you found me. I couldn't get down that broken ladder. Just jump! Like, now all we need to do is find Daphne and Fred and get out of here! It just sounds like I'm dying. Yes. Shaggy, try to find a way out of this castle, and I'll go find the others. Okay, so that gear's probably for the chain thing. And Scooby's talking to me like he's here, but he ain't. Just invincibility frames, thanks. I framed are great. It's this way? It's that way. I think I saw another... There we go. Anything... Oh my gosh. No, there isn't. But also, she was up like four flights of stairs. I couldn't get down the last stair. Why were you at the top? Because it's Velma and she was exploring and lost her glasses. Which also, I just want to point out, didn't she not lose them at all in this? No, she hasn't. Oh no, she did. It was in the first, first level, one. Yeah. yeah, you're right, you're right. She should have lost them like four times. It's Velma. My glasses, also. I can't be seen without my glasses. My glasses, I can't be seen without my glasses. That's the worst Johnny Bravo I have ever heard. It's better than yours. It, it was. I'll give you that. <laughs> Please recall. I could, just, I could just do a really bad Elvis. You could. Please recall, I'm going for sinus surgery in December. Oh. Sounds like a good time to do it. It's Try to convince them to take out your tonsils at the same time. They My won't. tonsils don't need to be removed. Lucky. Hello. Oh, perfect. Oh, come on. I love this kind of scene in the show. <laughs> you, you're making fun. This is a No, great that scene. made me happy because it's automated. No. Now, now, now Scooby's following the Ghoul King. Okay, There's the Ghoul King. He was saying stuff. He's not talking very loud. Did Twitch just die again? Yeah, this this crashed too. What the heck is going? What is going on here? I don't know. Me. Some strange technical difficulties this evening. It's pretty spoopy. So the game's back somewhere. There it is. Are you not recording this? Uh, it closed. What do you mean I'm not recording this? There's a button for. Oh, okay, you are recording in that version, not in Wii Central. Yeah, I wouldn't record in this. I'd be okay. like raw video. No, we, it just streams out to Twitch, and then Twitch records sense. it. All right, what did I get now? The gear. Okay. So hold on. Uh-huh. Uh, you actually want to go back there. Why? So... I missed something. This this particular puzzle is a little weird, so I'm just going to give it to you. Oh, right, this room. Yes. What sort of device might play a lullaby that'll make that thing go to sleep? How do I? See? Scoob, it's a newspaper. <laughs> Maybe like it'll that say that. <laughs> that the mystery's already been solved. That the mystery's already been solved. Alright, there's a picture up here. Yep. What? It's a painting from the museum. <laughs> and there's a door. Yep. I mean, I was going to use the music box, so. Sure. Uh-huh. Me solving things is not valid. It's only dog pulp. <laughs> no, it's more that... I was pulling it out as you were telling me. Oh. All right. And then we use. There's this. a gear that's not moving. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Item system that doesn't loop around. I. That should do it, right, Scoob? <laughs> A 
Apparently. Apparently that did it. Don't you know. See what else is out there, though, I guess. Yeah. Probably the bad guy. Or it's nothing. Or it's this. I've played video games before. An oil can. We had better not drop any of this. Someone might slip. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be a maze, by the way. And then it wasn't. And then it Isn't just was good? it was just doorways. I like when it's not a maze. What in the world is that thing? A tentacle monster. Yeah. I didn't know that that was a Scooby-Doo thing. <laughs> um, so is it out this door? Nope. Nope. No, it's, it's out the, the, the uh, at the end of the hall. Other... Down, 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 down. Down. This hall? Yeah, it's that one, because that, that's the door out the entrance of the... Uh... Right. <sighs> More tentacle monster. Get out of my way, Scooby. You're going to get me hit. What? You got double spooked. But it wasn't even touching. Whatever. Kid Scooby, I'm gonna throw this key at you. Okay. <laughs> a golden key. I bet this is the key to the mystery. Can I just get in the no, you can't mystery in machine there. with the gold key that says it's the key to the mystery? No. Because that would be, you know, the gold key to the mystery. Machine. It, it would. It's accurate. I'm not wrong. You're not wrong. That you can't walk down this path. No, I guess you have to find where the gold key and stuff goes. I have no idea. I don't remember the end of this. Stop. It's fine. Okay, well, we're done with that. What about over here? Nothing? What about over here? Nothing? Okay. So, now I gotta think about paths. Well, here we go. Where have you two been? We've been looking all over for you. We found the mystery machine. Let's get out Why? of here. Hold on. Why was there... Ve so, they were all kidnapped. Fred was, like, actively tried to be killed. Velma... Vel uh, Daphne was... Chained, chained up, up. But wasn't actually held in any way because you were able to undo the chains without any sort of locksmith and Velma was just at the top of the the tower with because of the broken ladder now I, I want to point something out here about Velma's predicament making it even more silly she couldn't fix the broken ladder but there were obviously three other ladders that she had to climb up that yes, she had to climb time. up and could totally have picked one of those up and put it down the hole or just jumped over the last two rungs that were missing I, let's assume she's got Ankles made out of glass, and she knows this, you know? Could be. Hold on, you two. We need to get to the bottom of this mystery. Shaggy, Scooby, see if you can't find more clues and trap pieces. I just keep changing his voice. Oh my voice. goodness, what oh is my... this voice that you are going for I was, That was not the voice I was going for. Did it come off of his Deltac support? Just a little bit. <laughs> oh, man. Now you just give him all the stuff, and... Um, oh, it. I have to give Freddy all the bits. Yeah. Uh, I need to hold on to that. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Oh. Probably said, yeah. The music box, obviously, you have to hold on to because you needed the. Uh... A chain. We're actually just lubing up a chain so that we can use it to, like, pull the mystery machine. We're gonna take the oil. A painting. It looks like a clue. You better let me hold on to it. It's totally not worth anything. Neither is this, uh, this knight's helmet. Ah, uh, it's probably not worth anything. Snow ghost mask. Really, Freddy's behind all of these? Yeah. Freddy and was the monster. He well, I mean that's that's what the Venture Brothers. <laughs> I I remember that. Like I said, I never I didn't see the, the the middle of that one. I watched them talk 
and then I came back at the end of the episode to find out something had happened. And that was it. I was like, I don't want to actually see this. Some Tibetan chimes. A Hanko chief. How's, how's that a clue? So I blow my nose, it's a clue? Well, if there were boogies in it, it could be a clue. DNA tying someone to something, but... I don't know that boogers contain DNA. Actually. I'm, I'm sure there's some DNA attached to them boogers. We're gonna... <laughs> you, you're not... Okay, hold on. I'm thinking about the items here. He, they're, We're going to sacrifice him to the Elder Gods. Okay, perfect. How's the newspaper a clue? I don't know. Newspaper, a hook, a net, handkerchief, some Tibetan times, witch doster, snow ghost, black knight, painting, oil, can, lion shade. We have everything to trap our mystery monster, but we need more clues. So you need to figure out where that gold uh, key goes, I guess. It could be past the, uh, it could be somewhere where the cogs are. Yeah, because there was that one other door. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was um, where the monster was. This way? No, is it, is it, was it? Up, no, it was up top. You're right. Yeah, this is this hallway. I like how this... this like. Oh, and that... Oh, no, we already Hold used on, the The decor key. has changed significantly in between some of these hallways. Yeah. Completely. It's not that one. At the end of this hall, there was another locked one. Right. You right. Ka clunk. Ooh. This is Ooh. interesting. This is a uh some old computers. Well, I mean this time frame, new computers. <laughs> no, well, I guess theoretically this is nineteen sixty nine. These would be very new computers. I mean, they could be World War II computers. Computer tape. This must have all kinds of information on it. Dude, do might you have 64 <laughs> kilobytes of information? Do you see Scooby? Oh. Hold on. He's actually Mr. Skeletal. Look. Like, full on skeleton going on there. That's not. There's no human in that thing. I don't think he saw a scoop. Let's get out of here. <laughs> so I guess you probably give the computer tape to... And then I come back up and, and you grab And come back him. up to trap him this way. That's a pain in the butt. Not that far. Oh, my God. <laughs> Need to let the stick go back to center. You say that as if that makes any difference. Scooby keeps walking in front of me and changing my direction is the problem. And then it, like, sticks me in that direction, and it's... Hey, gang, we found the Ghoul King! I, yeah, I bet you that's the last thing. I hope so. Yep. Let's meet in the torture chamber. I have an idea that should slip up our mysterious host. Let's go over the plan one more time, Freddy. Shaggy. You and Scooby will lead the Ghoul King through the castle and into this torture chamber. Being careful not to step in the oil that I will place down. That I will place down? What a weird way to phrase it. Yeah. When the Ghoul King steps into the oil, he will slip off the staircase and into this pit. Where Scoob and I have placed the net! <laughs> So they're trying to kill him as well. I think we're ready. Let's give the Ghoul King a real scare. Hurry back, you guys. And be careful. An hour, an hour later, it turns out the Ghoul King actually killed them both. There's supposed to be oil up here. There's no oil up here. Okay. Oh, God. You got all, all the way fucking through. So... I think it's this way. Oh my god. Why? Is this is this an area? No. It's just past this game. Oh my god, Scooby! At least Scooby can't be spooked. 
He just like shoved me into him. Yeah, but he himself cannot be spooked. So. Okay, so just down and around. I wonder if it'll actually make you chase him all the way through, or if it'll, or if you'll be able to. It'll, it'll just kind of. Oh my God, off. Scooby! Are you saying the pathfinding is going to be good? It's not. It's not that. It's that he just keeps. Yeah, he just walks in your way. He shoves me back. Yes. It shouldn't do that at it all. Does. Him being a solid object is like the worst part of this game. I hear things sizzling. I think after we're done with this, we're going to eat some food. I think it's dinner. Hey, Mr. Ghoul King. Like, can we ask you a question? Look at that chair. That's pretty pimp. I want one. You put some money into that. Dude. Run, Scoob! Alright. Uh, camera angle the first. This way. Just holding down. Just holding down. Holding That's all you down. gotta do. With any luck. Oh shit. Nope. Holding down again. Trying to remember which angles the cameras go at. So we need to follow the right edge. Oh, what? Oh no, he's blocking my view of where I'm going. Of course he is. He's there to be spooked. I... Oh my gosh. What? Oh my god. You're good though. You found the door. I knew where the door was. I was just concerned about the amount of spooping. You guys ran past. Ooh. Look how far he flew. Now let's see who this ghoul king really is. Lower the chain and hook, Velma. That is not the hook that you had previously. <laughs> no, but that's even more devious looking. <laughs> it is. Like, holy hell, mine was a meat hook, and that one's just like a giant fish hook. Torture hook. And it, well, and it caught him like this. Well, he probably grabbed on. I don't know. Rex Necros. Uh, everything said R. Necros, and you knew there was a guy called Rex Necros, and you didn't suspect him? <laughs> How did he not know? Maybe Freddy was behind all this. Jeez. Freddy is the demons. Um. Who? Yeah, that's what we're saying, Freddy. Of course, the newspaper that Shaggy found had an article on a Rex Necros, international criminal okay, mastermind. Okay, that makes sense then. It, well, no, but it was they, the... they, Well, hold on. They read the whole newspaper while Shaggy and Scooby were chasing him or getting chased by no, him. No, they had some time because you had to find the uh, you had to find the key and come back. Oh yeah, too. he was just like, this newspaper might be useful. We better read it. What's in this newspaper? Oh, hey, an article on an international criminal mastermind. That's kind of weird. Yeah. I'm kind of into this, though. I'm going to read this. What a quinky dink. Hmm. This looks like a clue. <laughs> <laughs> I see. The paintings, the jewels, the masks, and all of those invoices. Why do you have invoices? I don't know why he had invoices. That seems like the worst paper trail mess ever. Those must all have been part of Rex's crime web. Like, all those creepy things were meant to scare us. And spookiness Big makes D Scooby and I hungry. Oh, is this hunger meter? Is it sad that is that sad that it was his it was this hunger meter? Oh, is that what it was? That's what it, it wasn't his scaredness. It wasn't his sanity. It was a hunger meter. He was getting hungry. <laughs> Mummies? He, yes. he just he said there's mummies, I, I Yep. Looks like a pretty clever plan, Rex. I would have gotten away with it too. If it weren't for your meddling kids. And your dog. He didn't say that. I know, but that's usually the next part of the line. Yeah. Boy, 
That sure was one mixed up mystery. Rex Necros is going away for a long time. So wait, wait. Supposedly Rex Necros is going away for a long time, but... Where's the police? Yeah, the police aren't here, and all they have to go on is these guys who are about who are just gonna say, "Yeah, he locked us up." Well, yeah. Did you take like? Maybe now we can celebrate with the sandwich. Wow. Don't you guys ever get full? Like only when there's no more food. That sounds awful. Sounds like he has an eating disorder. Yeah. Which. He does. That's, Maybe. that's kind of no. He he definitely does have an eating disorder, because the amount of food he eats and how lame. There we he go. Is. We did it. We got some credits. That was a lamest high five. There you go. That wasn't very good. <laughs> we'll, we'll go with it. Hand turkey. Hold on. Hand, hand, hand chicken. There. <laughs> hand turkey. I want to know the uh, who did the actual voices. That's quite a good name. Andrija. Dijovsky. Birdie Vanasupa. That's a um, good name too. Not a bad game in many ways, but the controls kind of were the biggest letdown. And the weird, like, Scooby. So, okay, I, I hate doing this, but like, so many games get controls wrong. If your game doesn't control well, it kind of ruins the rest of the game. This wasn't a bad game. No. It was just like, every time we change the scene, your character a continues. Special thanks to Bruce Riley. Hold on. We don't actually know who did the who did the uh, audio. It's not listed. Although it could it be might under be down THQ. Here. It might be down here. Um, I don't know. It's a solid game. A few good levels. Some fun stuff. I mean, it's for a younger age group, obviously. Rated E for everyone. Warner Brothers Interactive. Lots of credits. Um. No, I, I mean, I would definitely say this is a good game for a younger age group who's into Scooby-Doo. There are, I mean, Here's there Hannah are... Here's Barbera. There, there you go. Scott, no, that is one of the guys who does who normally does the voices. That's pretty for, good. For Shaggy and Scooby. Yeah, but I think he's done the voices for both of them in the past. Yeah. Um... Well, no, it sounded like it. Oh, and that's it. Yeah, that's it. It's just... There's no... Congratulations. No, like, nope, there's no epilogue or anything. There. No, there's nothing else. <laughs> I love the weird little skull. It lights up when you uh, select that. Yeah. No, I mean, I don't know. I. Not a terrible game. Definitely playable. Um, has the same weird control issues that a lot of these early 3D games had, where you change a scene, it's fixed, and. You know, what's nice is that you, you're holding left, and it keeps you going left, but it seemed to have, like, drift. Like, you were very obviously going straight down that hall near the end, and I would start going to the one side a lot. Well, the other, I mean, the other problem is, if you're holding left, you may keep going left, but the seed that you've gone you're into... You're going might, right, you're, might, Yeah, you might be yeah. going right, or you might down or up, or something and, like that. And it seemed like t up and left on this, and it could be my controllers, it's getting a little loose already. But... Up and left, they would just walk really slow rather than run. So who knows? It, it's an N64 game, so... The big thing with this, honestly, that or one of the big problems with this, I think... I love how it gives you the answer to that puzzle near the end of the game. And it shows you that, yeah. The one problem, I think, with this with this game that's is... That's at that, a different angle. Is it? I think so. That, that's interesting. Um, Is that... You say, you know, good game for a younger audience, but some of those codes are actually... Some of the, like... Yeah. Codes, especially the Tiki level, were way too complicated. Well, well that was a, just it. The, the third... The third piece of information that it gives you to shiver nothing. me timbers, nothing. Useless. We're gonna take a break in a second. Yep, we're done. Yep. We just finished the game, so we'll be out. We're second. just talking about it. We got, so, we out got. of ten. Yeah, that's fine. Out of ten, what, what do you get? I'd say it's like a seven out of ten for an N64 game. There's, there's not gonna... It's solid, it plays, it's not super long, it's not... The only real complaint is the controls, which are a big kick in the pants, but... You know, a lot of these games on N64 I was gonna say, have the thing that. is, you, have to, you honestly have to forgive the controls, because a lot you, of stuff you, you of that kinda, era yeah. was like this. Well, it still, it still puts a mark down. You can't give it a high score because of it. I'd say seven. Um, seven's a pretty good score. The, the west-north-east code... 
and the three, four, two, one. Um, those could obviously be solved without knowing how to talk to the parrot, but that's a lot of trial and error. Uh, yeah, the first time I played the game when I was a lot younger, I did in fact just keep trying codes until I got three, four, two, one. Yeah. I I remember the piece of paper that I had written with one, two, three, four, one, three, four, two, etc. Just trying them and trying them and trying them. Dude, there's like 30 some odd. The bad yeah, thing I is mean, with just one, you've got four options, and then you get four, four. 16. Were there only 16? I think it's only 16. Could be. Oh, All no, right. no, there's, there's one there, and then one there. Uh, sure, well. <laughs> there's food things happening. All right, we're going to take a break. We'll yep. be back with something else. We will be back soon.